Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. This article comes to you guys from Business Wire. I'll leave a link to it in the description so you guys could check it out. So T-Mobile again trying to use its its brand presence and brand strength in growing in small market rural areas. So T-Mobile powers up Friday night lights to give one small town a two million high school football field makeover. And there's going to be several other towns that are going to get some type of funding. So it says in addition to two million grand prize, T-Mobile is awarding 25,000 to 16 finalists and giving 5,000 to 300 high schools throughout the competition's entry period during support football programs nationwide or to support fo football programs nationwide. So this is again, this is T-Mobile using their 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 marketing power, their their strength to to gain brand recognition in these smaller towns some of these smaller towns they they might be new with coverage and retail and and they're looking to gain presence so of course if if t-mobile gives one one of these high schools a big makeover it's probably going to receive a ton of t-mobile marketing right uh, posters this field was remodeled by t-mobile whatever they're gonna put they're gonna put billboards and posters all over the high school letting the people know locally that t-mobile was the company to invest in the local community and that's what they're gonna do with all these other high schools and that's how t-mobile is going to gain brand recognition and that's how people start knowing about t-mobile that didn't know prior and that's how t-mobile gets foot traffic into these retail stores that they just write the retail distribution piece. They're, they're putting new stores. They're trying to grow the market share from basically nothing to something, right? If they, they start most of these, most of these small markets in rural areas that they bring new coverage to and then new retail distribution. I mean, T-Mobile is starting at zero and they're trying to get to two, three, four, five percent. But there is a lot more work that goes into it besides just the network and the retail as it pertains to the small market in rural areas. They have to get make people aware. They gotta bring they gotta bring the they gotta bring brand presence. And they're doing it in the big way. I mean giving giving out money, right, that that usually tends to resonate, especially if it's for for uh, for makeovers. And I'm sure a lot of these high schools can use the money. For for the for the football program, the twenty five thousand, the five thousand probably gets you know, new uniforms, whatever the case may be. And it's going to be noticeable. It's going to be a noticeable uh, fund. So T-Mobile is doing it, right? T-Mobile is is, uh, <clears throat> is doing it. They're doing the hometown grants. And now they're also doing it for, for the football makeovers. So this is going to help T-Mobile in the long run. This is going to gain them brand recognition, as I mentioned. And people will switch to them. They will see, oh, T-Mobile, they, they just... They upgraded our local high school. Let me let me see what they offer, and that's how they get people in the doors. And then they they give them the value, and the savings, and people will will switch in in that regard. Especially now, where the economy is heading, people will switch for a cheaper cost. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. Let me know if you've seen a, a makeover maybe in your smaller town. Let us know in the comments. Like, share, subscribe if you're new. Follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Live. See y'all in the next one. Peace.